B. 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 Jarvis. B. B. Yo, what the fuck? So do you know what happened to him? Do you know how he died? Unfortunately, I don't know a thing. How is it they don't know? Ain't that the coroner's job? The coroner? I actually wanted to come here for a different reason. I needed to come here for Jarvis. I refused to let him die without justice. Justice for what? You know something we don't? I don't believe he committed suicide. See, what you don't understand is, I fucking hated Jarvis. Jarvis is a piece of shit. You know what, Drew? That man did not deserve you. I'm, I'm just so over this. I, I'm over. Yeah, since you got that motherfucking expensive motherfucking bracelet from your secret booze, come to think about it, you ain't even tell me his name. Shit, like I don't know. Y'all slept together or we were together. I've always denied it was him. And I'm not talking about this here. Look, that video is not what it looks like. I swear to you, I didn't kill him. It's because you love Jarvis, and giving him away his things ain't gonna change that. Oh, boy. <laughs> what you doing working out at this park, man? No, it belonged to my grandpa. He gave it to me right before he died. It's like a family heirloom. You say that like you want kids someday. With the right person, yes, I do. But if children is nowhere in our future, I guess I have to give it to someone I love. So when you start working out with Jury on, Oh shit, I forgot I had this on. Listen, yeah. I need you to take this and put it in your pocket and I'm gonna come get it from you tomorrow, okay? All right. Just hold on to it, don't lose it. And if he was, why is that any of your business? He wasn't even talking to you. He was talking loud enough for me to hear. And Jarvis is my friend. He was laughing too. <laughs> Who the hell are you? Jarvis and I ran with the same crew back in the day. He never spoke of Malcolm as being a boyfriend. Says another one of Jarvis's exes. I'm not an ex. We never even looked at each other like that. So, this detective thinks Jarvis was killed. Remind me who Jarvis was again? So you really think he was murdered? I don't know. That's just said it was suicide. She said that night he took a lot of hands. Suicide?
I believe he was murdered. And I was wondering who I was involved with that. Look, you really don't have a choice now. Don't stress yourself out about this. If it's Kabari baby, then it's his baby. And if it's mine, then it's our secret. If I'm pregnant, it's his baby, Jarvis. <laughs> you pregnant? You serious right now? You can't be serious. You serious? You pregnant? You pregnant? Yes. You gotta have a baby. <laughs> I know it. You damn right I don't. And if you're pregnant with my baby, you better find a way to sell Kabari. Cause nobody's playing daddy to my child but me. Because you knew that baby could be Jarvis's. It's not his baby. It can't be his baby. It only happened once. It only takes one time, Ash. Even I know that. It really doesn't matter now because Jarvis is dead. You cheated on me with this new guy that you're with, and you expect me to forget about it. Then you cheat on Malcolm with me, and you expect him to forget about it. At what point do you accept accountability for your actions? Do I know you? No, but I'm sure we know of each other because of Jarvis. You must be Grayland. It's nice to meet you. If I may ask, how long have you two been together? October would have made it four years. Hmm, that's interesting. Seems to be more, longer than any of his other relationships. I don't recall any of his relationships being any more than five or six months. Nothing. Yet. I just wanted to be nice to come introduce myself. You know, since this kind of makes us friends. Buddy. Mm. Interesting. He was there too. I'll be seeing you. I wasn't just gonna let Jarvis get away with what he did to me. There was no way in hell I was going to let him get away with it. He was going to pay. Sitting alone in the park, girl, is never a good look, so I guess that's right where you belong. Come a little closer. I'll show you where my foot belongs in your ass. Excuse my friend. He grew up around a lot of violence. And my family is all killers. No, it's not that. I think I've seen you somewhere before. Yeah, I mean, that's cute or whatever, but like I said, I'm sorry for bumping into you. No, you one of Jarvis's friends. I'm sure even more things gonna come out about Jarvis nasty ass that you didn't know. Like what? You know something I don't know about? I won't be here that long. I was just looking for Kelsey wherever he is. Mm, well, I haven't seen Kelsey since he ran off with you and Ahmad. Don't worry about your friend Graylin. I'm sure he appreciates your support. 
Yeah, but I feel bad to have left him there. And all the clues we discovered this far, they were really starting to make sense. Really? I thought he would come back and fix things with you, man. I would definitely give you $20 if you actually want to talk to him. Uh, make it 40 Did I say it was any of you? I'm sure you all know that Jarvis had pictures of every last one of y'all on his phone. So I'm starting with you all before I went elsewhere. So are we murder suspects in a murder that 